the presentation of proclamation designating March 2022 as Social Work Month. And Vice Chair Scott will read this uh, proclamation. Board of Supervisors, County of Lake, California, proclamation designating the month of March 2022 as Social Work Month. Whereas the social work profession for, for decades has been dedicated to improving human well-being and enhancing the basic needs for all people, especially the most vulnerable among us, particularly during the global pandemic. And whereas this year's Social Work Month theme, The Time is Right for Social Work, embodies how social workers rose to meet the most pressing challenges of all of our lifetimes, the COVID-19 pandemic. Even as our nation continues to grapple with systemic racism, economic inequalities, global warming, the need for improved health care and, and other crises, and whereas social workers have always helped people overcome issues such as death and grief and help people and communities recover from increasing natural disasters such as fires, hurricanes and earthquakes brought by climate change. The social work profession is one of the fastest growing careers in the United States. With more than 715,000 social workers today and nearly 800,000 professional expected to be employed as social workers by 2028. And where social workers possess the necessary expertise to assist our nation in some of the most demanding concerns, including their health and well being, not only during the pandemic, but for all times. Social workers work in all facets of our society and meet people no matter where their circumstances and empower them <coughs> to live their fullest potential. And where our social workers at Lake County Department of Social Services assist a variety of populations, such as the elderly, dependent adults, and risk, risk families and children. Now, therefore, it be proclaimed that the Lake County Board of Supervisors hereby declares the month of March 2022 as Social Worker Appreciation Month in Lake County. Recognizing that social workers' profession makes society a better place to live and by advocating for positive change and encourages all citizens to consider social work during the month of March and throughout the year. Passed and adopted this first day of March 2022. Thank you. I'm sure you have something to say. And I think Sam wants to get a picture. Oh, when you're done. Oh, okay. All right. Well, we are here today. Um, first, I would like to say thank you to all the social workers in Lake County. Social Services is not the only employer of social workers here. And the last two years, social workers have been very busy, um, busier than they typically are. Um, today, I have here with me um, Amy Shemansky, who is the Program Manager for Adult Services, Public Guardian, and In-Home Support Services, and Mary Pagan, who is the Program Manager for Child Welfare Services, where we also have Adoptions and Resource Family Approval Program. Mary is also the manager for that program. And we have Social Worker Supervisor, Sh Sherry Delatore, who's seated. Um, but I want to thank them especially for showing up today. Um, the social work programs at the department are core programs, um, very important for the community and for the work that we do here. We are ex extremely uh, grateful for their dedicated, hardworking, and compassionate um, work that they do. And uh, they continue to collaborate with each other and with the community, both on a professional level and with um, those people that they work directly. And so I'd like to say thank you very much. I also know that we have um, some child welfare social workers and staff on Zoom, I hope. They were going to Zoom in today. And so I've been a social worker here for Lake County Child Welfare for 22 years. And I thought the best way to honor um, my colleagues, my fellow social workers, not just in child welfare and adult services, but all throughout the county. We have amazing social workers in the medical field, in the tribal community, and in private industry. There are a lot of us here in Lake County. So ironically, I'm going to read a poem. <laughs> and here we go. Being a social worker means you'll never be bored. You will always be frustrated. You'll be surrounded by challenges. So much to do and so little time. 
You will carry immense responsibility and very little authority. You'll step into people's lives and you'll make a difference. Some will bless you and some will curse you. You will see people at their worst and at their best. Add to your breath. You'll never cease to be amazed at people's capacity for love, courage, and endurance. You'll see life begin and end. You'll experience, experience resounding triumphs and devastating failures. You'll cry a lot. You'll laugh a lot. You'll know what it is to be human and to be humane. So I just want to say to my fellow social workers, we see you, we value you, and we appreciate you. So, um, Take that mic and bend it down. Um, Got to set it up for the short girl. Thank you. <laughs> so um, I, hard to, pass, to follow that up, Mary. That was beautiful. Um, I'd just like to echo the sentiments of both Crystal and Mary in that social work is bigger than just social services, but on behalf of those of us doing it at that level, um, I'd just like to thank them all for, for what they do. I came into the system as a social worker. I always felt a deep connection to the work. Um, that sense of satisfaction when you can help somebody on an individual level get past a crisis that they're going through and a sense of maybe pride and accomplishment for doing that and the pride that they hopefully all feel even when you can't solve it. Um, we all know there's a lot that it's not always a happy ending and you don't always get to fix something or, or have the achieved results, but um, the social workers stick with it and they keep doing the job and um, I've been out of the field for a little over three years now, but I still feel a deep connection to the work and to the people doing it um, and the challenges that they've gone through the last two years during the pandemic. It's, it's different. We do the work different now than we did before, but they've stuck with it through the changes and I think that the clients are still being served. Nothing there have not been any gaps there despite the fact we may be working from home or over phones and doing things a lot different um staffing challenges all those things and so i just appreciate what the social workers do and i'd feel a little remiss if i didn't add on the fact all of the other people whose title might not be social worker who are part of that you know whether it's the supervisors or the aides or front reception who touches every case um, they have to have some credit here too so thank you to everyone for all they do and we appreciate you <laughs>